Hi, welcome back to Art by Brooke. So as you can tell from the title of this video and also from the vase, I am celebrating a huge milestone in this video. So back in December of 2019, I published a video of a tree ring paint pour on a vase. Now I've done many of these, but this one was pink, black, it had purple in it technically, but you didn't really see any of the purple, and also gold. That video has just passed 50,000 views. This is my highest view video on my channel, and I am just so blown away and so excited and grateful, and I wanted to do a video celebrating that. It seemed like people really enjoyed the pink and black over the vase, so I decided those were the colors I was going to go with again. So all of the colors are listed down in the description below, but I have pink, I have a color shift pink, and I actually use a little bit of that in my pink to kind of dull it down and, and bring it to a similar tone. I have black, white, and gold. So I'm going to go ahead and put those in a cup and we will do the tree ring pour. Also, I have a canvas underneath so it'll catch the runoff from the vase. At this point in the video, I thought that I was going to be doing a separate video with the canvas that was underneath the vase, but I decided after the fact that I wanted to include it in here. So stay tuned to see the canvas painting. Okay, so that is looking so cool. There are actually cells in the vase, which I don't usually get, but I think my colors were a little thicker this time. We'll see, they may end up stretching out, but they look cool for now. So I'm going to take the vase off the canvas and then I'm gonna let it sit. And I think that I'll probably take some footage once it's dry or mostly dry, because at that point, the paint isn't continuing to move. Right now it's gonna keep moving for a little while.
Okay, so the painting has been sitting for probably about 15 minutes and it is dark, so it might be a little tricky to get the close-ups, but we're gonna try because I think it looks really cool. So up here we have a lot of pink and black, which see it's the camera's blowing it out like crazy. Let's see if I can adjust that. That's a little better. And this white through here almost looks like a butterfly wing or something like that. I think it's really cool. And it has some of that gold behind it and more of the black and pink. This definitely got a lot more muddy than I expected because I tried to keep my paints pretty thick, but I think a few of the colors weren't as thick, so you didn't get quite the same effect I was hoping for. But I still think it looks pretty neat. And over here, you get some more gold here on this corner. And of course, as usual, this will be more shimmery when it's dry. So I think I'll do a quick clip of me turning the vase here after this. And so then you can kind of see what it looks like still wet. And then I will also do a clip when it's dry. I just wanted to say thank you so much to everyone who supports me and watches my videos and likes and comments and subscribes. It has meant so much to me and I still look forward to creating content to share with all of you. If you have any suggestions for videos you'd like to see in the future, please feel free to leave them in the comments down below and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you so much and I hope you have a great day.